my name is Zelda. You may have met me on other videos before that I have posted, but clearly I have a different look going on. That's because I've been possessed by aliens. I can't really prove you all that, and that's why sharing it isn't a huge threat to my possessors, but um, all I can really say in light of convincing you is, why not believe it? Anyways, that's beside the point. I'm speaking today on an issue of another type of possession. Something that you may have already encountered yourself. This is a type of addiction so awful that it has ensnared almost every single person who chooses to use it. The government denies its ill being to humanity because it doesn't necessarily conflict with the framework of the system. But this addiction is really harmful and it will take over technology. Oh, jeez. Technology is great, but like a lot of other drugs, it's too great. And soon it's going to melt all of our brains. So, I've developed a five stage recovery process called human. Well, let's get right to it since the average attention span of today is about seven seconds. Seven. H is for hunger. Technology has literally made us hungry for more and more entertainment, and we can never feel ourselves to be bored. So pay attention to the hunger that you feel when you limit the amount of time you spend looking at the television or down at your phone. Is it really healthy to crave constant gratification? You. Understanding. You should understand your technology before you overestimate it. We expect way too much out of technology. The videos have to load faster. Why doesn't this game have better graphics? Never forget. Don't even drop my phone. My Never forget that behind every machine, there was a human who made it and intended it with a purpose. Metacognition. Metacognition means to think about the way you think. It is important to constantly assess reality. Look up from the screen for a second. See where you are. Now, when you look back at it, think to yourself, what am I doing online here? And what is that going to contribute to reality? Also, it's a myth that smoking weed is a great way to escape from reality. It's great, and I'm not going to discourage it at all, trust me. But it can be a problem when you use it to improve reality. Animals. Animals. Humans are the only species that is currently being affected by the plague. By the plague. They aren't very intelligent, but the way that animals think is pure. Oh, you're so cute. Thank you. Thank you for helping me. Stay connected with animals and recall in yourself what it feels like to have an animal mindset. Nature. Just like animals, do not overlook the greatness of trees. From an alien perspective, trees have completely dominated the earth. Humans can't live without them, but they can live without humans. humans. Yeah, it's more entertaining to play Candy Crush than stare outside your window on a road trip. But even though games are good for you, it's good to a certain point. That's all. Technology is a drug, and trust me, I'm the kind of person who supports drugs. Just don't let drugs abuse you.